Dragon Ball Super fans from all around the world, it looks like we have some new information coming in that pertains to Dragon Ball Super Episode 74, courtesy of course and translations by our good buddy Herms98 on Twitter, so in case you guys don't want to find out what happens during Dragon Ball Super Episode 74, this is your chance to fast forward the video. So without wasting any time, Dragon Ball Super Episode 74 is entitled for those he loves, the indomitable great Saiyaman, the vile criminal Wadagash commits evil on Earth. Now check this guys, Gohan hears that Earth has been infiltrated by the mental parasite Watagash, who infects the darkness in his host's heart, giving them superhuman power. Meanwhile, Barry Karn hates Gohan and tries to catch him with a honeypot trap, but fails. Watagash then appears and infects him. Pan this week, kidnapped by the bad guy and in big trouble, Pan is abducted by Watagash, who's been taken over by Barry Karn, but despite Gohan and company's worries, Pan herself is more than fine. Great Sam Man's greatest crisis. So it looks like we're gonna have ourselves something very similar similar to the Potafu story with the copy Vegeta scenario as this Watagash person is looking to infect and pretty much taint the host's heart and allow the darkness to emit from them and according to this of course due to the title for those he loves it looks like Pan and Gohan are both going to have a very significant role in this and since of course Barry Karn hates Gohan he's going to catch him with a honeypot trap but fails obviously enough Watagash then appears and infects him so it looks like Watagash is going to be carrying on over from episode 73 it looks like this is going to be Jocko's responsibility because Jocko was said to have been capturing a criminal and of course the criminal escapes so it looks like the criminal is going to make his way uh, towards earth and of course we're going to have ourselves a little rumble between the great Saiyan man and it looks like Pan is also abducted by Wadagash but according to their translations it's said here that Pan herself is more than fine I really don't know how anyone is surprised by this because after having a look at what Pan was able to do against Trunks and against other characters Pan even though as a baby as an infant she's more than capable enough of handling her own even at such a young age so obviously enough guys expect more filler before the universe survival arc which is going to be debuting in february and of course january 7th dragon ball super english dub is going to premiere alongside dragon ball kai the final chapters guys i mean not much here to look forward to obviously enough if you guys love the great sandman if you guys love pan then i mean this is your story because gohan is finally going to have a, a somewhat back-to-back -back episode as episode 73 he's going to be starring in his own movie and of course episode 74 it looks like he's gonna be after what a gosh but post your comments down below guys what are your overall thoughts on gohan's role and what's going on with pan is pan gonna be the hero here because this is set to be gohan's or at least great sandman's greatest crisis so it looks like pan's gonna be in trouble here but what are your overall thoughts going into this episode guys post your comments down below thank you all for watching once again if you guys are excited for dragon ball super in 2017 in which case we have a lot to look forward to don't forget to punch that like button square in the face guys make sure to get this video out to your friends your family and your family dog be sure to subscribe for more information guys and i'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below take it easy guys and god bless peace